All right, this is Bruce Posner with my first YouTube po post-game report. And of course, tonight the Terrapins uh, easily dealt with uh, Delaware State 172 to 54, really behind the energy and strength of Dino Gregory, who's becoming a much, much better starter as the year goes by. Dino, uh, seven for 10 from the field, a uh, couple hit a couple jumpers, eight rebounds, 14 points. As the Terps were unable to get the ball into Jordan Williams down low, despite the fact of playing Delaware State, a much smaller team. Gary said afterwards that Delaware State was able to deal with the fact of having, uh, of dealing with Jordan Williams because they're always facing much bigger teams and they were pretty effective. Now Jordan Williams and Sean Mosley were both shut out in the first half, yet Maryland was winning 40 to 21, mainly on the strength of a 19 to three uh, rebounding edge. Payshon Howard came off the bench for Sean Mosley, hit a couple threes, and kind of stabilized the lead for Maryland and got him rolling. Adrian Bowie wound up with 11. Maryland really dominated this game wire to wire. The second half was almost uh, just Gary tried hundreds of combinations, just experimenting uh, again and again. Baron Weiss came off the bench, uh, put in, I would say, nine strong minutes, three baskets, uh, some rebounds, a couple blocks, played very well. Uh, who else? Uh, Cliff Tucker, 15 points, six for seven, quiet from the field. Kind of reminds you of Landon Milbourne last year, just always hits that 15 point figure, but you don't really see it too much. But it was a good bounce back game from the two disappointing losses in New York. And this will be the first of my many YouTube reports of all the events I go to, not just Terrapins with Ravens or whatever. So uh, we hope you enjoy it. Give me some feedback and let me know. And I thank Matt Zenitz for being my cameraman tonight. Take care, everybody.